Why, hello. We're back. We're back with the man himself. The big K. Little special K. Time to re- yeah, re- ta oh, what? Mm. Time? Time for the re-undead to re-dead the undead. I... I feel like I just had a stroke, Billy Snake. Thank you. Does anyone else smell toast? So where do we leave off? Kane, that's right, Kane is exploring the ancient citadel of the old vampires. Oh god. Hey. What's he doing here? Ow. Holy snake, was that revenge for my little inflation as a conspiracy by big, small to sell more or less? Is that, is that revenge? No, not floor hands, floor tentacles. I, I love how when he dodges, he uses mist form. That's so good. It's it's like good little detail. So cool. Ugh. Answer me this. Answer me this. Why do they call it oven when you oven the cold food? I don't hot eat the food. Not riddle me that. Riddle me that. Oh, hello. You're new. Oh, come here. Come here where I can see you. Come here where I can see you. Lead well enough. Okay, so you're human. So how's everybody doing? It's uh, it's allergy season again, so my nose is horrible, and I can barely breathe. It's great. I love it. Stop that. Ow. Enough of that shit. There we go, got one. Got another one. <laughs> Another one. Wait, there's another gun. Let me win. Ah! <laughs> oh, rain keeps the pollen down. That must be nice. Must be nice to have rain. We don't have rain. We just have fire. Did you guys see the Aurora over the weekend? The Aurora was pretty nuts! Huge, huge coronal mass ejection. All rain, no Aurora. Big F. Here, oh. no doubt, was the evidence Mobius wished me to have. For the vampires had prophesied not one, but 
two champions. Oh. One destined to be Nordsgoth's redeemer, the other its destroyer. Oh. The vampire's hero wielded the reaver, forged for this very purpose. His opponent was clearly the champion of their adversaries, the Hilden, and brandished a flaming sword. The foretold outcome was unambiguous. The vampire hero would fall. Oh. What do you guys make of that? Ow. All right, let's do the trick. A little troubling, isn't it? some additional enhancement before this door could be opened. Ah, no dice. No dice. Oh, there we go. I have a disc. A wheel of life. A wheel of life, you say? Interesting. Remind you of anyone? Who do we know that uses phrases like wheel of life? Who talks about wheels a lot? What could it mean? What significance does this little artifact have, I wonder? What is the significance of that other little mural? With the... The other champion with a flaming sword. Does that sound like anybody we know? Whoa, what? That was a sick dodge. Dude, stop dodging! Look, dodge this, motherfucker. I can dodge this. Yeah, right, there we go. Jackass. Oh, we got it. Okay. I hope you're doing well. Busy time, so no new audio atrocities. Good. I can only offer you one splayed hand and one eggplant. Sir, I graciously accept your splayed hand and eggplant. Thank you. Wait, not like that. That's not. God damn it. He said the thing! He said the thing! He said the thing! Oh. There we go. <laughs> it's that kind of stream. You know, I think if you look inside, um, Bad ducks. I think you'll find that you had the power inside you all along. Oh, unlockable. Ow, stop that. God damn it. The 
power is bacon. Remember one time when I was a kid, uh, a big old windstorm knocked down a gigantic tree and knocked up the power of the entire neighborhood. It was great. Huge tree. Hello. There we go. Who's asking about Wide Tom? You can't you can't handle Wide Tom. You can't handle Tom and his widest. Power. Come on. <laughs> you no, I can't eat him off the map. Alas. <laughs> it bounced. Oh man, there are so many in jokes. Is Wide Tom an in joke though, or is Wide Tom just a fact of life? Yeah, the real Wide Tom is the friends we made along the way. Oh, time for a jump. Ooh, a gate. Uh, and invisible walls. Excellent. All right, let's go through the Stargate. those guys. Well, we know how we deal with those. Come where I can see you. Ah! Scenery's in my way. Ow. Man, Dux, what the hell is a chicken smoothie? You know what? Never mind. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. for the telekinesis. Uh, ow. Oh, but he sends me flying easy enough. Oh, God. Uh. Stupid camera. Frames from the dodge happen when he's like right when you hit mist for him. That's that's actually really good. Let's see, turn to mist. Can't hit me. Mist, missed me. Love doing that. Ooh. Ow! He did not like that. Mad ducks. I can't check my DMs while I'm streaming. That's rude. Ow. Ow. 
Yes, charged. And there we go. Okay. Well, we opened the door. Where did we open a door to? Ooh, secret. Door? No door. Door? Uh, that's the way we came in. Ooh, blood pot. Helpful. Ah! Where'd you come from? still alive, I just don't care. Oh. oh, hello. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, more of you. Okay. Ow. Ow. Damn it. All right, teleport strike. Oh. Time to feed the sword. Time to feed your swords. Very important. All the nutrients a growing sword needs. we have down here. Maybe there's secrets. Oh yeah. This is a mural that Raziel hasn't seen yet. I don't No, that was the first one. That was the first one he saw. The one about being the vampires getting cursed. But this gate wasn't here in the future. This game won't be here in the future. Goddamn time travel bullshit. Kane has nothing to say about it. Yeah, Kane doesn't give a fuck. Kane's not exactly the mural reading kind of guy. Oh. These statues were singularly inanimate. I knew better than to assume they would always remain so. Ah. Mr. Genre Savvy. Kane knows what's up. Kane knows statues don't just stay statues. He's, uh, he's played a video game or two. Oh, this is the Fireforge. We've been here. Or rather, we will be here. The, the, is there a... Okay. You can come out and play? There you are. It will... It will not have been here later when we were here before. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's it's not here in the future. Because I guess... I guess Kane destroys it. You have will be an R currently here. Yeah, it gets a little confusing. I think it's kind of cool, though. To, to visit locations in two different time periods. You're like, oh yeah, I was there, or I will be there, or I haven't been there yet, or... Oh, 
Yeah, so this tells us that these forges are part of the Vampire Citadel. Which we hadn't initially realized, or rather. So are we at now now, or are we past it? No. No, we're not at now now just yet. Or maybe we will be. See ya. Coffin. Dude, come on. <laughs> you guys. Uh, nothing actually in here for Kane. Not so fast. <laughs> Let's see what else we have down here. Uh... Nope, Kings knows. Is this only here so I can get up there? Oh, it is! Maybe. Yes! You know, why am I fighting these guys when I can just do this? That's a symbol we haven't seen yet. What forge is this? This is a new forge. This is not one we've seen. What's that symbol? Hey look, water. Oh, hello. That's, that's a key for one of those slots on the wall. Come back. Yoink. Hard stone skull. You should not be touching that. You need to worry about it. A little bit of water is fine as a tree. <laughs> you know, blood is mostly water. Jamie, you can't break the enemies, contort them into keyhole shapes, and use them as keys. That's... Honestly, it does sound like something Kane would do. <laughs> Whee! Ooh, secret. Suspicious statue. Oh, hello. God damn it, stop. Can't go in there. What's in here? Uh, 
Nothing, okay. What about in here? Or is this where we just came from? That is where we just came from, okay. Uh, so I need that. So where do I find that? Oh, another broken door right here. Yeah! You're not dead yet. Now you're dead. Okay. We got the other key. Let's go. Let's rock and roll. That's water. That's water. I'm not gonna touch that. What? What can I not? Did I get it? How come I can't get it? Why can't I get it? It won't. It won't let me. Let me. What's going on here? Dip my toes in? Okay. Well. So much for that. Uh, ain't the drama queen. <laughs> I know, right? Ugh. Okay. What else have we got to work with here? Not much else. And I can't get there because there's nothing to stand on. Okay, let's look around some more. Let's look around some more. Maybe I'm just missing something. I mean, I feel like that's the solution. I feel like it's like reach out and zap the button, but it won't let me. It doesn't want me to. So why doesn't it want me to? Is the water in the way? Reach out and zap some. Oh, you mean like, like these. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Drain the water. Now, still can't do it. Well, maybe from right here. There we go. You know, I feel like Kane could have just grabbed that. He didn't need the platform. The third fragment of the Balance Emblem endowed the Reaver with the elemental power of lightning. Yeah! Lightning. Hell yeah. Pillar of energy, motherfuckers. You guys, I think, I think that's cool. Uh, the Elder Emblem powers that can't get are all from the pillars, which is neat. Originally, that was how the glyphs were going to work in the first game, because the glyphs would all be tied to one of the pillars. And then the reavers would be elemental, but that got cut. That's a big one. It's a big fella. Come 
I'm gonna quote Will if he does a dub. What do you mean, if? What do you mean, if, sir? I guarantee you some dumb shit's gonna happen. Over 90 mods? Jesus. A lot of mods. Why do we have so many? Can we, like, return some of them? Oh, hello. Ow! Not fair. Okay, well, you know what? Lightning. That was kind of cool. Oh! Yeah. Come at me, bro. Oh. Ow. All sales are final. He did not like that. Ow. Greedy. Ow! Stop it! Ow! I consider this to be the third game I remember, and this is the third Raziel game. It was the third game that I ever played. Pieces on me? Is that what just happened? Ow. Aha. Get reversed.
Uh. Okay. Oh, fireballs. Okay. That's how we're doing this. Ow. Ow. Ah. Ow. No fire, please. Please, no fire. Ah, fire. 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 Ah. Yeah, still fire, okay. Still fire. Uh. Ah, fire, okay. Ah. Can't see what I'm doing. Ow. I missed it, I missed it. Ow. Oh my god, it's Doc. Hey Doc, what's up? Fire is hot. Yes, it is. All right, backtrack. Hey, Doc. How you doing? We are. We're just hanging out. We're playing some Legacy of Kane, my dude. How's Canada? Canada's good. We had some Aurora. It was great. Um, also, smoke. That was less great. And I, I just, I had a, I had some, some blackberry cider for the stream. It's really nice. Yeah, things are, things are pretty good. How you doing, bud? Ah. Ow. Two, two broods of what? Okay, I know nothing about cicadas. I have not heard this. Well, explain. Ow. I made them hit each other. Yeah. That's the trick of these guys. If you can make them hit each other, they do counterattacks on each other. I think I understand. That's interesting. I didn't know that. That's really interesting. No, not on me. I'm trying to throw you in the spikes. Yes. Got him on the spikes. He said the thing. You know, I hope this is like really interesting cicada trivia, etymology trivia, Doc, and not like not a setup for some kind of really obscure joke. Although I admit, if this was a setup for a joke, it would be pretty good. This, how good a joke is is directly proportional to how long the setup takes. Isn't that, isn't that true? Somebody told me that once. 
maybe I just wished it was true. Maybe it's something I just choose to believe. So, you know, I've heard cicadas, but I've never actually seen one. It's a king's room. Surprise! Hello. Hello. I have traveled in time from Napland. Very good. You have traveled in time and space to join us. Yes, now. I have. Hey, wild king's room is here. Surprise! Uh. Die. Getting wrecked by fire statues. So Kane discovered something interesting, King Bro. Where did he discover? The, the chat may have missed it. Kane discovered that um, the the champion of the ancient vampires, their supposed savior, uh, had an adversary with a flaming sword and was prophesied to be, to, to defeat the champion. He doesn't have a flaming sword, though. No, but do we know somebody that does? Uh, yes, and this is name. Yeah, I know exactly who that is, I think. Is why? it my boy? I mean, if it was, why would why would Yanos think that he was the vampire's savior? It's not adding up. That, that, this, this doesn't add up. It doesn't make any sense. Time nonsense! What's going on here? Ow. Okay, just one now. Also, Doc is uh, educating us on cicadas. Hold on. Let me set you up with a uh, local stream here. There's a doctor in the... There's a doctor in the chat! Yes! Although Hi, Doc! I don't think he studied at an accredited institution. Well, I mean... How do you know? He calls himself a doctor. Yeah, well, chiropractors call themselves doctors, too. <laughs> Hi, Doc. I promise not to feed you Moxie. Or Moxie and Malort. No! No, my lord. Maloxy. No! No, no, Mox Lord. That's what somebody called it. No, don't inflict that on the world. Yeah, it was, uh... Mistakes were made. Very much mistakes were made. No, my emperor, don't eat the mold! I maintain that Mox Lord sounds like the most cursed magic card. I, I summon a Mox Lord. No! Oh god! Chat's threatening to eat mold again. Don't eat the mold, goddammit. Okay, here's a po uh, poser for you, Will. Okay. What's worse, mold or my lord? Um, why would you say the same thing twice? I think I would eat the mold before I drank Malort. Yeah, same. Because at least the mold kills you. Relatively fast. <laughs> Malort, you have to live with. Okay, but how do you explain Tom? He willingly drank like five shots of that stuff. No, that wasn't Tom. That was Cap. But how do you explain Captain Obvious no, then? Nobody can explain Captain Obvious. Captain Obvious defies explanation. Captain Obvious is a cryptid. He's a cryptid of the BPL. Yes, he is. So here's the mural. No. Yes. See? See, look at that. It's the vampire champion being slain by a Hilda with a flaming sword. What the heck? Really makes you think.
Oh, so we have lightning powers now. A new now. area of the vampire Shocking. citadel lay open. I still had much to discover. Oh, Mordor's mansion! Hell yeah! Did I come at a good time or what? Yeah, sure did. <gasps> Mordor's pimp-ass mansion. Mordor's mansion is fucking sick. Like, it's... Imagine the kind of mansion an ancient vampire would have. Ostentatious as fuck? Yeah. Nestled deep in the Black Forest, <laughs> Vorador had once held court over a private Dang! kingdom, as decadent as it was depraved. Now, all was still. I hoped I had not arrived too late. Pretty sick, huh? Dang! Vorador got a... bomb-ass house! Yeah. It was a whole lengthy sequence in the first game. Poking around through the various wings of the mansion. Who is the lady voice? Oh, King's Row. Hello! Yes, this is King's Row! Also of the Black Pants Legion. Yes. I just tend to not... I, I tend to be in the background a lot. Well, we're trying to change that. <laughs> yes, we are. Alright, secret secrets. Where are the secrets? Yeah. I often have to work late, or I fall asleep, because I'm a dum-dum, and I live in the mouth of Hank, so... Uh, no secret, but soul pod, that's useful. Uh, no. Alright, let's try the door. Whoa! Uh oh. Oh, we got a war up in here. Uh oh. Oh boy. Uh. Ah. Ow. See, I'm like, Kane, Raziel cannot do <laughs> this for him. Trying to make them hit each other. I don't think that can happen. Nope. Get it? They can see. I stand corrected. And sometimes they'll counterattack each other. Like if you hit them too many times, they have like a get the fuck away attack. And sometimes they can trigger it on each other. It's great. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Like watch if I hit this guy too many times. Watch. See? Quick cooldown. If I do here. He'll do like a... See that right there, that's his get the fuck away attack. Which they only do if they take too much damage in a short period of time. Almost feels like cheating. Ow. Hey, who said you're allowed to interrupt combos, buddy? Get away from the opening is the trick. Well, so much for the property value, I guess. Yeah, also I think uh, the whole silent entrance thing is a bit of a wash. Yeah, your sneaking mission is over before it even began. Stealth is optional for this mission. Oh, hey. An insubstantial barrier. Ghost mode. Time to make it a haunted house. It's already haunted. By what? What do you think? Uh, horrible demons and a vampire? Hey, look, there's the man himself. Statue of Borador. Who puts a statue of himself in his own house? Borador, that's who. Also, me. I would totally do that. That explains so much that's about you. Doesn't Strahd have a statue of himself? And a painting. Yeah, see? Right? Strahd is not someone you want to model your life after, I'm just saying. I, I'm, I'm just saying Strahd and Bordor have a lot in common. I think they get along well, if, if they ever met each other. 
Or they'd kill each other in about five seconds. Or that. Uh-oh. 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 Okay, well, let's see how many of these I can catch. I know it. I gotta switch to Air Reaver. Because I wanna blow him away. Yoink! Let the bodies hit the nice, nice cookie. Gotta feed the reaver. Yeah! Tornado! Hey, watch this. Yes! I got him on the spikes! <laughs> nice! Okay, let's look around. Oh look, it's a painting of a of an ancient vampire. It's a heck of a haul. Ah, Doc remembered my old nickname. Thanks, Doc! Your old nickname? Keeper of the Squish. Oh yes! Yes. Somebody once told me. Sneak, 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 sneak. I'm being sneaky. Nope, sneak. Ah! Well, so much for sneaky. On fire. Ruin their days, Will. I got them both. Mmm, fricassee. Yeah. If you kill everyone, you don't have to sneak. That's... That's good. That is an excellent point. It's kind of how I wound up playing Splinter Cell a lot. Oh, what are you going to use for your new intro music, Doc? Nice. I mean, terrifying. <laughs> no, it's a thing. Fire Reva. It's on fire. Too hot to handle. The Zorg Reva. Okay. So, statues. Ooh, door. Ah. Little, little sconces. Yeah. I bet those statues come alive. Probably. Put your sword away, Raziel. Ooh, fancy! Ooh. I want a courtyard like that in my house. This is all inside his house. Good lord! How, how cool is this? <laughs> this How rich pool is seemed this related dude? to the portals which had transported me into the vampire ruins, but its surface was disturbed by the spouting of these gargoyles. Like, this is all indoors. How cool is that? I guess you don't get to be an ancient vampire without developing a sense of style. Dang! Right? Hey, Mordor! Oh, he... Duck's made it... Made a duck version of the A-Team theme. Yeah, he did. He sent it to me. Ah, 
Shadow's Angie. Angie ghosts. Ah. More Angie ghosts. Go away. Ooh, soul pot. Ah. This mural was similar huh. to one I had seen before in the fountain room. Hang on a second. It's a winged dude. Stabby stab. Oh, oh god. Oh god. Excuse you, we were trying to to admire high art. I put that one out. <laughs> out of his misery. Yeah. All right, so it was a it was a winged vampire stabbing a dude with a spear. And the winged dude was purple. Well, the old vampires usually were blue. It looks like Vorda being notable, except of course Vorda wasn't actually an ancient vampire. He was his first generation. This mythology is very confusing. Yeah. Stop that. Yeah, why does why does he have so much water in his house? Uh he's showing off. Is he the kind where if he gets in the water he melts? He's like the vampire equivalent of those guys who like put snake venom in their coffee. Why? To show off how much cheesemo they are. I I will never understand the yeah, the cheap I don't thing. really get it either. Water in house in middle of a swamp. Yeah, that's that's the real reason. This is house is built in the swamp. It just flooded and he went, oh well. That's why he has human servants to deal with that. This door clearly required some artifact before it would open. Alright, well, let's shift. Hello. Ah! Demons! Or whatever they are. I don't know what they are, but they're freaky. Those those bodies they're possessing have uh, have wings. Like the ancient vampires. Did Rossing go? I, I know all the other folks working for Kane, their little what do you call them said weird stuff going on too. Yeah. Maybe, maybe these are like Raziel and I, I don't know. I had a thought and then I lost it. I'll get back to you. Either that or somebody's making fun of Raziel. I mean, I guess it's possible that in Thordor's mansion there were corpses of ancient vampires because you know he did he didn't know most of them. He was he was around when the ancient vampires still walked the earth, or you know. It could be some of them got killed during a party. Yeah, or like they were just buried here. Or it's like poltergeist, and he built it on top of a burial ground. Oh, maybe. Bodies in the floor, yeah. <laughs> That's the same one. Okay. Yeah, we just did all that to get back where we started. Well, no, I think we're on the other side of it now. Uh, probably. Secrets? No. Barrel. You and your secrets. Barrel. Oh, that's not Barrel. Sorry. Sorry. No, that's a person. Well, look, I'll make it better. That's not better, that's worse. I mean, would you rather they be chained up? No. <laughs> huh. Climb the chimney. Oh, 
Ah. Whoops. Oops. Sorry. So sorry, Mordor. It's... Will, you're, you're gonna ruin his property values That's, at this rate. That is the first time shrapnel has ever had an effect on the wider game world. <laughs> I do like how they added that little touch, though. That's neat. Alright, I need to find a good corpse. There's one. Okay. Now... Yes, now I can go up here. gets me where exactly oh oh ah uh. so I think I know what to do next here Oh, joy, it's my least favorite thing, jumping puzzles. No, not just jumping puzzles. You notice how those um, those pillars have a spiral motif? Uh, are we going to be shifting in and out of reality again? Possibly. Whoa! Yep. We doing plane shifting. Oh, God. Or you're falling down if you're will. Yeah, we're that. Oh hey, it's Diggs. Oh god, why does Diggs have a sword? Uh I don't know. I think Diggs just met up justice to a uh, somebody in chat. Rip. <laughs> Evil! Evil. Hi Diggs. It's Diggs Day. Happy birthday. Every, every day is Diggs Day. Especially when you're him. Especially when you're Diggs. Oh, god damn it. Every time. <laughs> well, that's what this stream is going to be, ladies and gentlemen. Me falling off a pillar. Will, we're facing his greatest nemesis yet. Yep. Gravity. Yep. Glad to know it's not me this time. Yeah, well... For those of you not in the know, it is a running gag with Will and me that I routinely fall off things in um, tabletop games. And sometimes have things fall on me. Oh, uh. Uh, can I get up there? <laughs> okay. He should really appreciate the gravity of the situation. Yeah. <laughs> Need a little snack. That'll do. That's good enough. Cookie, I think I know why he has so many batteries in his courtyard. He ah. needs fertilizer for the trees. Go away, I want to stop auto-locking onto you, you stupid things. Cameraman's trying to kill me again. Apparently. There we go. No. God damn it. Okay, so... Gets me up there. And then I can. Maybe, maybe I'm overthinking this. Maybe I just have to glide straight across. Maybe I'm overthinking this. You overthink things? Nah! It's been known to happen. 
Here we go. More than a few times. Nope. Won't make it, but maybe. There we go. Well, it took like half an hour. Nah, it took more like 10 minutes. <laughs> and thankfully, the door is open on this side. Oh, Cookie has birthday cake. Is it your birthday cookie? I didn't realize. Tres leches. What is that? You, you friend, have an excellent taste in cake. What is what is that? <gasps> You've never had tres leches cake? No. What is it? Oh. All right. Whenever you come down here, I'm feeding you that cake. What what is it? What is it? Tell me. Three milks. Three whole milks. Uh, it is an ultralight sponge cake soaked in sweet, in three kinds of milk: evaporated milk, condensed milk, and whole milk. Okay. And it usually has whipped cream and strawberries. Ooh, yum! It's a lot of fucking ghost eater things and the. Ah. Why am I fighting you? I can just shift. See ya. Yeah, so now we're in the mansion proper. Oh, dang! That, uh, the floor tile is straight from the first game. Oh, listen to that thunder. It's like the Resident Evil monster should come wandering around the corner. Yeah, it does, isn't it? I'm having Spencer Mansion flashbacks. Hey, it's another... another vampire. This statue appeared to be the same hero I had seen depicted in the fountain room. This had to be significant. Hmm... And there's a button behind him. Button. Button drops thing. Oh, and look what's behind him. A little light orb. Hey, a thingy! I wonder if we hit that light orb with the Dark Reaver. Ah! Hey, there's one matching each element. So we're playing Find the Orbs. Okay. There's one. Oh, but there's fire, so I can't... Ah, but there's a gargoyle! But, but, but Raziel. Your What's it looking your, at? Your head's not supposed to go that direction, Raziel. Ah! Like Exorcist! I, I realize... I realize you're dead. But... Oh, jeez! Make dude. it stop! Come on, dude. Okay, so now we cloak. <laughs> Now we can hit it with another gargoyle. Okay, it's two. Now where are the other ones? Oh, there's one. It's outside. How do we get outside? There's one up there. There's one up there. Okay. Anything. Yeah, Will needs to make peace with the camera guy. If I ever find where the camera guy lives, he's... He's not gonna have a good time. Maybe that's why he keeps hiding from you. Yeah, that's probably... you're probably right. Oh god! Ah! Oh, there's a gargoyle up there. Okay. So I got a Why? I got a cloak. And then he can't flip the thingies on me.
Okay. Wait for the reset. Cloak. Now we can go. There we go. Easy. Now I just gotta find three more. Okay. Well. Oh. Okay. Yay, time jumping puzzle. Oh, and more cloaking. Good thing I'm already cloaked. I came. Ah. Uh, uh, God. Ah, don't Shit. fall. I fell. Okay. Hit the button. Platforms extend. Cloak. Come invisible. I like how when you when you're invisible, your shadow disappears too. That's. That's a nice touch. Good attention to detail. Would be an easy thing to forget to do. Come on. I want you to do the thing. There we go. We have to hit it from a specific spot. I gotta hit two more. Well, one is one outside. Of them's outside. How do I get outside? Oh! There's one up there. Okay. Easy. Ah! Okay, gargoyle turns the climbable wall not climbable. Excellent. Kind of a jerk move. Well, I guess I just gotta be invisible then. I do like how the puzzle in this game leverage like the reaver powers. Really neat. Makes them feel impactful. Oops. Well, it still counts. Well, I mean, it worked. Still counts. <laughs> if it's dumb and it works, it's not dumb. Still counts. Okay, how do I get outside? Maybe there's a door? There is a door. There we go, easy. God damn it, we're off. <laughs> greedy, greedy, greedy. Eh. Put the hitbox in the most annoying place. Yeah. All right, there we go. That's six. Dramatic camera. Camera guy showing off now. Hey, check out this new drone I just bought. Drones hadn't been invented yet. I said what I said. That's how old this game is. This right. was indeed the hey, vampire look, warrior camp. depicted in the fountain room, for here was the hero's weapon. This could be the key to solving the riddle of the fountain. The riddle of the fountain. Heart seeker. Did I come this way? I did come this way. Wasn't there another door? Yeah, oh, but that's... That's a reaver I don't have yet. Okay. Camera guy is also a time traveler. Well, everybody else is. Why not him too? Oh no. I just made that guy hit his buddy. Ah. Ow. 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 Stop that. Why you do that? Snack time. There we go. Now we're talking. Oh, we got a posture check. Thank you. I was a little trippy there. Thank you, sir. Oh, uh, that was me. Oh, thank you very much. Gray sword. 
Yay, fire! By Zork be purged. Give me your souls. Give, give me your souls. You're like, no. I'm using it to panic. Give, give me your souls. Can I set you on fire? I hope not. It'd be kind of funny if they could. Got one. And the other one's just smoldered and died. Except for you! I love how dramatic you were when you said that. What? Except for you! Yeah. You gotta be dramatic. It's important. Somebody has to be. Eh, fair enough. Alright. Well, back we go. You know it'd be funny if you went through all this and then the front door opened? That would be funny. Corridor's there, he's like, oh, there you are. <laughs> Expecting you. I was wondering what all that crashing and screaming was. I swear to god, that statue wakes up, I'm gonna be so pissed. I'm gonna laugh my head off. Okay, we went left last time, let's go right this time. Oh, that's fun. The ambience of this level is so good. Just the, the torches and the cracks of lightning horrible, and the completely empty mansion. And the horrible demons coming out of the walls. Yeah, that's that's pretty good too, yeah. That's alright. I, I like the rest of the ambience. That's just it. That's just gravy. Well, that's just the game dance being like, well, we gotta do something to break up the walking through corridors. Although, for, honestly, I would be perfectly happy just to walk through corridors and not fight these guys. I think that would be pretty cool. Yeah, or have you wondering the whole level where they are? Yeah. I, I do think this game leans on combat a little bit too much for, for padding. Yeah, agree. It gets a little bit tedious at times. But at least it's more interesting than the other games, so there's that. Yeah, flows a little better. Probably why they did that is because they were like, hey, we can actually lean on combat more now because there's an actual combat system. Let's show off what we made. Yeah. Alright. Uh... Right. Right. That's how we get up Whee! there. Oh, I have that one. These gargoyles were effigies of the vampire's enemies. In the corresponding murals, they were impaled by heroic vampire warriors. Perhaps this was a clue. Ah. All right, so we find the one that matches the one we just got. Which I think and is this one. Stabby, stabby. No, it's not that one. This one? Yeah. Why is the statue bleeding? Uh, don't worry about it. All right. Cassus, that is some nightmare fuel. Well done. Oh, well done, Castus. 
Wee. Hey, we're in a greenhouse. Where are all the plants? Also, we're in a greenhouse. Bonk. I need to find a corpse. Body, body, who's got a body? Maybe there's one down here in the gardens. Plus, he's got huge gardens. Here we go. Hey, there's one. Oh. A puzzle door. This mysterious chamber was clearly significant. Perhaps I would finally find the elusive Vorador within. Ah. Uh. No, Kai Harper, I'm pretty sure there's not a green box in the house somewhere. Well, who told you about green boxes, Kai Harper? Maybe he's read right in. Yeah? Are you a fan of the opera, Kai Harper? Plants are all dead because I'm making a brown house. God no, damn it. No, it's um it's a brown house that Tom lives there. I don't get it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Raziel is the reason for the goddamn green box. Yeah, Raziel's what you put in the green box. Alright, so. Okay, yeah, Kai Harper's written. He knows what happens out. if you go on one too many nights at the opera. So, let's do them all at once. The braziers were all lit, but still the door remained sealed. Perhaps I had ignited too many. Oh, well, I guess we better find a way to put some out. Can't the rain do that for us? Uh, maybe. My Tom's Bean House, House of the Bean. Uh, I would green box that, but I don't think it would fit. You know, that reminds me. Thank you for, uh... Thank you for reminding me, Sire of Sons. It's, uh, it's time for a quick break while we, while we uh... We have we have a message from our sponsor. Hey there, folks. It's me, Tom Tombadil, owner and proprietor of Wide Tom's Bean House. We regrettably had to close our doors as the Department of Health deemed our air quality suboptimal. Too much methane, apparently. I am now proud to announce that Wide Tom's Bean House is not only back, but better than ever. Our new location is chock full of windows and cattle grade air purification. The burger bar is bigger and badder than before with new toppings and an array of meat as well as other a la carte items served throughout. So come on down to our new, legally safer facility to have a belly bustin' good time. And don't forget to stop by the gift shop to pick up some new Wide Tom's Bean House memorabilia. And we're back. Well, that was a thing. Yeah, but you weren't expecting that. I uh, know. No, I wasn't. <laughs> Have you not seen that? <laughs> no. <laughs> I am. I have.
many questions I don't think I'll ever get an answer to, so I'm not gonna ask them. I'm not gonna question the madness. I'm just gonna let it happen. Look, we just we do some things here at the BPL, and some of them are ill-advised. I think my sanity score just tanked. Also, god damn it, now I want a burger. Burgers are good. I had one last night. Well, and I want another one. What'd you have for dinner tonight? Uh, leftovers. Leftover burger? Uh, no, because there was nothing left of the burger. Oh no. How tragic. I mean, it was real good. I'm sure it was. <laughs> yeah, that, that quote there, Night Owl, that might as well be our motto. Which one? We do some things oh. in here. <laughs> BPL that are ill <laughs> Like my lord. Yeah, I... Yeah. You, you had... You took it in two different times, dude. You I, got nothing, nobody to blame but yourself. Three, actually. What was the third? I've only been present for two. Okay, so... I've had... I had... No. Because, okay, so the first time I had my lord was at Gen Con when Aaron Karsten of RPPR made me drink some. Yeah, and you warned me then. Yeah. Um, the second time was at the the, um, the first meetup that you and I went to. And the third time was at the last year's meetup. <laughs> so yeah, three times. You are a madman, sir. Yeah. Hey, by the way, speaking of green box and stuff, if any of you guys have not heard of uh, RPPR, Roleplaying Public Radio, they they do actual plays. They do they did a bunch of Delta Green stuff. In fact, um, Caleb Stokes, who now writes for Arc Dream, is uh, is one of their their regulars. I think Ross has done some writing for them too. Ross Payton. Yep. Anyway, they're cool guys. You should check them out. Just don't drink the Malort. Don't drink the Malort. <laughs> Right, Diggs very farms burger. That sounds like a great idea, Silicon Soul. I wasn't aware Diggs had a farm. You've never heard it. You, you don't remember Diggs very farms? Because Diggs very no. farm remembers. Does it remember me? I guess. Isn't that ominous? You know what's not ominous is setting your enemies on fire. Yeah, it's pretty. That guy ran into the fireplace. <laughs> <laughs> well, you were <laughs> Talk about, that was him. talk about out of the frying pan into the fire. That was even more on fire. Alright, well, that's a uh, weakened wall. Oh, but we gotta turn off. Oh, I know. We gotta bring fire to turn off the fire. That makes no sense. Well, it didn't work, so I must be wrong. Somebody once told oh, me. We got a subscriber. Oh, hello. There we go. Thank you for the sub, Battle Pumpkin. The spice must flow. See what I did there? Yes, I did. I just didn't want to acknowledge it. Oh, don't touch the mist, okay. I was gonna ask Vordor why is there cursed mist in your mansion, but then I remembered this is the spectral plane and he probably has no control over what's here. You'd probably be very confused. Yeah. Ooh, body. Why is there a body underneath the f That's not even- there's no- where is- where- uh, uh, what? What? <laughs> what? Uh, Mill over here having a hard time with physics. Yeah. 
Yeah, screw you guys. Why are oh. you still questioning this? I mean, I realized it was the designers having made a really cool choice and then kind of having, like, backed themselves into a corner on it. As far as, like what you as, did. far as environment design. So I, I understand. It just still makes me go like, what the hell? is in the concrete. Yeah, it's like Rebar. That would make a cool band name. What? Corpse Rebar? No, Corpse is in the concrete. That's pretty good, actually. Yeah, you're right. Happening, so that little shimmering bubble they had, uh, that was bouncing my own TK shots back at me. That's why I kept getting knocked over. Because you were shooting yourself. I shooting, yeah, I was hitting myself. Stop hitting yourself. Stop, Stop hitting, hitting yourself. yourself. Stop hitting yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Concrete shoes, Jimmy Hoffa's casket, and that's a lot of radiation. <laughs> <laughs> You guys are the best. Yeah. I'm told it's the equivalent of a chest x-ray. Hey, there's a button behind under this table. And it's Push the button. Smashable. Broke your table for it, or uh... that last one's a real banger, yeah. It's 3.6 minutes long. <laughs> Don't mind where said banging is coming from. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's dark. It's from under the floorboards, right? <laughs> or is that a little, little too Edgar Allan Poe? Yeah, it's a little too Edgar Allan Poe. You know, originally, uh, the Telltale Heart was actually about Tom Tombadil, but it had a slightly different name. Uh... <laughs> God! <laughs> you win! <laughs> you broke me! <laughs> that was pretty good. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, true, sometimes you gotta let your inner edge off the leash. Besides, being wholesome all the time is overrated. Oh, I wonder if... I wonder if I can do some sick gliding here. Probably. <laughs> Did it. Yes. Excellent. I made it. Man, when I was a kid, I wanted a library like this. This Vordor has at least two libraries like this. It's dope as hell. I know. This mansion's fucking sick. Okay. I think you might have to go invisible. No gargoyles this time. Oh, I see. 
It's a race. Made it. Nice. One more. Where's the last one? Hey, that painting's all wobbly. It is. Maybe I could smash it. Yeah. Yeah. Screw your painting. Ooh, new one. What's this one called? Oh, it doesn't have a name. Okay. All right, back we go. It's a long walk back. A little bit. Again. Good lord. Borodar has a fancy ass house. Yeah, he does. But it's empty. Where is everybody? Mm hmm. Dead. One assumes. Yeah, didn't Ariel say that he. But, uh, but for Kane, he's the last of his kind? Yeah, I think we know what happened to them all. Yeah. Ow. Well, that's just rude. No! That's just even ruder! God damn it! You know what I said? Uh, maybe the statues will come alive. Uh, I was kidding! Uh, oh god, there's four of them. Three. Oh, phew! But. If I can get them all together. Yes! Aha! Go get him, Will! I'm making the game right. So don't break the game! Yes, yeah, see, he just counterattacked. Aha! One down! The trick is get them to kill each other. Ow! Ow! Or you can just stand in between them and get pummeled. Or that. Ow. Will, stop catching things with your face! Kane has a slightly different timing for his dodge eye frames, which I guess I'm used to. So I keep dodging all the time. I like how they slow down as they get more and more injured. Yeah. The insurance is going to be pissed with the paintings. But yeah, never mind the statues. Those things looked expensive. Do you know how expensive oh. animated statues are? Oh, he's got good insurance. He's a vampire. Of course he does. You know, because vampires and insurance... Uh, oh, her. It was her, a her. bit of a stretch, I admit. A bit. Yeah. It sounded clever in my head. That's okay. <laughs> oh no, Mer Emperor's friends just discovered my lord. Oh no. Are they okay? Alright. Probably not. <laughs> I'm going back here. If I remember 
remember there were a couple of walls here that had that one of those heroes on them. And I think those get cracked too. Yeah, screw you guys. Screw you guys. Screw you guys. Yes. These murals were attuned somehow to those in the fountain room. For this wall too had shattered. That's the trick. Now we can get in here. Sneaky. I still need whatever that is. Well, I have no doubt we'll get it. But I'll bet you that's where the last weapon is. Aha! Oh, what is this? Pillars with elements. So there's four, so I guess we're making the f four outer ones. I guess. There we go. This arcane emblem would unlock the sealed door in the crypt. Perhaps. Half of Orador's crest. But which half? Hmm. Yes. <laughs> Very good. Was not sufficient. Ah. There was clearly still a missing piece to this puzzle. Okay. Okay. Maybe there's other ones somewhere? No, that just goes back there. Oh. That just connects the two rooms. Yeah. Go away. Go away. Go away. Stupid TK shield. See ya. Bye. Think. Let me think. Courtyard again? Uh, I don't know. Might have to go back to the courtyard. I guess what we're doing is we're looking for more walls that have that that motif on them. Whoops. Whoopsie doodles. Whoopsie. 
And oop. oh, I just noticed that. Hey. You haven't missed much, Sire Sons. Just uh, us trying to figure out where the secrets are. A lot of wandering. A lot of wandering. A lot of backtracking, a lot of poking things. A lot of will falling off things. Yeah, speaking of which, we're about to do that again. This again. Midnight, no. Stop it, Grimos. Why would you put that image in my head? Ah, shit. I'm good, I'm good. Okay. It's tricky because I can't really judge where. Ah! Uh, can't judge where my shadow is. Where am I going? No. No. Well, I think it was easier in the other two games because the camera wasn't fixed, so you could actually tell, like, where you were relative to things underneath you. It's a lot trickier in this one. That's all the cameraman's fault. Why are you guys saying each other's names in chat like that? What are you doing? What's going on? What shenanigans is this? Got it. And there. The ritual. What, are we trying to summon something? We're we summoning, like, Captain Ox or something? It's customary. Oh, just a moment. One moment. Okay, I'm good. Turn off. Lux has detected that the sun has gone down, so it's trying to darken my display. And I'm like, no, I don't want to go to bed. Okay. Uh. Okay, now. That's why they were saying each other's name in chat. I do that with one of my buddies in real life. <laughs> I call him a doofus in all caps. He calls me a nerd in all caps. <laughs> why would someone do such a thing? What, tease their friends or...? <laughs> Aha! Um... Uh huh. Oh, it's a secret. Okay. Oh, it's a secret to. Well. Okay. Nothing in here. Nothing in here. The answer must be elsewhere.
Nothing here. Nothing. Oh. No. No, okay. Just a weird texture. tried to interact with that statue in uh, material yet. Maybe I should try. Go poke it. Oh, Cassis wants you to use your reality rewriting powers. Oh, not sure what that means. I wasn't aware I had powers to rewrite reality. Okay, no, can't do anything with it. I, I'm not really able to bend the fabric of time and space to my will. Castus, I wish I could. It'd be dope as hell. Wait, soul pot. What about this big painting here? Does this count? It does not count. Nothing here. Nope. Not dealing He's with you. Nothing here, he says, while running past enemies. No, nope, nothing here. that up. Let's try this one again. Shh! Battle pump and don't tell people! <laughs> Otherwise they'll lock me in a glass box and poke me with ah. sharp objects forever. That's different. We're making forward progress, I we think. Are. I think we are. So maybe somewhere here, there will be a mural that I can smash. Aha! Oh, we're back in the greenhouse. There is. Uh... Whee! <laughs> What's that? Raziel fell down the well? <laughs> At least it's not Timmy. Yeah. Aha! I like the dramatic zoom in. Aha! I made it just in time. Nice. Ah, here was the second piece of the emblem. Now, undoubtedly, the crypt door could be opened. Raziel, buddy, pardon me for me to question things, but. Where the heck's the rest of your rib cage? Um, he lost it in the abyss in about a thousand years from now. Looks like it hurts. He, he, he did say something about um, unspeakable pain and relentless agony. I mean, that would explain it. Okay, can't do TK underwater. So I guess we'll have to come back here later. Wait, there are escape plans? I wasn't aware there were escape plans. You can't escape. Uh, no, I mean, they have escape plans for in case weird shit happens. What? Who does? Greenbows. What, what kind of weird shit? I don't know. In case my powers of 
bending reality to my will go haywire? You have powers of bending reality to me? <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure, Will. Of course I do. How come I wasn't informed? I don't know, same reason I didn't find out I had reality bending powers until about two minutes ago. Maybe you used your reality bending powers to forget that you had them. Mm. What does he do about this? Oh, okay, it's an escape plan as it come free me. I work retail. I'm used to fuckery. Trust me. Ah. Just rude, he interrupted your combo. How dare. Unbelievable. Well, I'll just juggle him then. Beat him to the sword. I'm just gonna keep juggling him for a while, but okay. Did I miss one? Some somebody still alive? I missed one. How the heck did he get away? <laughs> like Will, stop! Do that. Stop playing with your food. Oh, no. That wall. Now we can finally get out of here. Ah. 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 Ow. Dodge for your life. Ow. No, nope, not that way. Ow. Fuck off. Cameraman's like, hey, guess what? Cameraman didn't want me to find the exit. No, he wanted to watch you get et. Et. Corridor ever gets lost in his own house? No. It's probably been here for thousands of years. Then why does they have doors that can only be opened with the Soul Reaver? Um, that is a really good question. Oh right, because Mordor made the Reaver. Maybe he made himself a key. Fuck off, ghosts! It actually does make a kind of sense. This goes. How does it go? We gotta light them all. Oh, isn't that what you did before? Now we gotta fight the dudes. I believe in you. Ah. Called it. Also, the dudes are on fire. Well, I better switch reavers. Ow. The same tricks don't work with these guys because they have a 
close enough to do the thing. Ow. The mighty hand of the programmer coming down and saying, no. Close enough. Yeah, we can't get them close enough. close with this third and final weapon the mystery of the fountain would finally be solved end stream before water forage cookie says yeah i think that's a good end point just before we head to the water forge sounds like a plan man i don't want to go for too long okay time for a snack I am low health. I'm nom 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 nom. Let's try and not knock you in the water. Come yeah, here. Oh, hello. Hey, look! More snack food. Uh, kind of them to deliver. Your takeout's here. Yep. Oh, I'm, I'm sure gonna take them out. Hey! Trevor says they really don't want to die. Well, that's the thing, right? Is they can't be the same ones because I keep eating their souls. So it, it can't be the same ones. It's, it's new ones. It's gotta be. Unless the force animating them is not... Well, I don't know. Oh, are you suggesting someone's returning their souls from the wheel? Yes. Why, who, who would do such a thing? Uh, your former employer. Mr. I am the center of the wheel himself. You mean Tony J? Yes. Oh, that guy's having a Wow, that guy a... is... Okay. Uh, okay. You're right, you right there, bud? Uh, apparently breaking physics over there. Yeah, okay, he's fine now. You hit him so hard, you, you uh, punched him inside dimensions. Yep. So, you know, actually, right after Water Forge is Vorador. Or do we want to leave that until next time? Let's leave it until next time. Okay. The ancient vampires were weak to water, or if that was a 
That was a weakness of the the human, the first generation of human vampires. Mm -hmm. Anyway, now we got this shiny portal, which we could jump into. Swan dive. Ah, next time. All right. There we All are. righty. We're gonna leave it there. So thanks everyone for another time traveling side coin tenebrous whatever Tuesday. Whatever the heck we're calling it this whatever time. Whatever we're calling it now. Thanks for hanging out guys. Hope you were entertained. You've been a lovely audience. Hope you guys have a good night. See you next time. And don't eat the mold. Don't eat the mold. <laughs>